So here's this mini fridge ice chest that I have made by taking a Peltier thermoelectric cooling unit and sandwiching it between this big heat sink and this small heat sink which is a cold side in here and for running it I have a small 12 volt battery and I have a charger on it so it doesn't go down since that battery is not in its best shape. Uh, but I've got a beef, I have a fan on there, a pretty powerful one, um, and a small little fan on this side, and, uh, let me try to hold this with the camera and get my, uh, temp gun, and it's, if I can get it on there, it's about 70 on that thing, but, uh, let me put it on the lid, and I'll show Okay, so I have this on there, and it is cooling down on the inside. And so it's about 78-ish. I just have my finger on there accidentally, so it sh showed it warmer. But uh, I have a little hole in the side of this. I'll put it in there. And you can already see it dropping. But yeah, this is the one side at the top. And this fan I got out of a old power supply. But to make this, you just order a little thermoelectric um, piece. You can get them at like this one. You can get for like uh, 345 on eBay. I saw it was the cheapest. But, uh,. You just get one of those and then find some heat sinks and you'll have to make sure it's got a good contact or it won't work and it'll burn up the thing and you'll want to be careful torquing it down but I just got this uh, cheap about five dollar ice chest from the convenience store and then cut a hole in it for this and put a fan on each side and yeah. And so I will get back once it has cooled down a significant amount. Well, it's been about nine minutes since uh, I cut out the footage, and it is now down to 59.6 degrees. Just about nine minutes. And it's not that bad.